Second, if she says, こんなの初めて。She is thinking as if. メシラジョークサポートジャパン。Hey guys, it's メシラ。Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm a comedian. I'm a introduce funny Japanese culture. If you are interested in that, Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and please check out my Patreon too. And I'm organizing my solo stand up comedy show in Tokyo. If you are interested in that, please check out the link below. So, see you in Tokyo. Many foreign men who come to Japan now have a problem. Japanese women are always so nice to me. I don't know what they are thinking, especially before going out with them. When I ask them out on a date or when we went out to dinner together, they would give me a very nice comment or reply to my question. But after that, they stopped contacting me at all. The reason is simple. Japanese women make full use of tatemae before and during a relationship. Tatemae is a form of flattery used to avoid offending the other person's feelings when communicating with others. For example, when I tell Japanese women I'm 34 years old, they often say, Oh, you are 34 years old? You don't look that old at all. What they actually mean is, I thought you are much older. Japanese women use tatemai so as not to hurt men or make them feel like jerks. If you are worried, they will use tatemai for the rest of their lives and you will feel distant from Japanese partner forever. Don't worry, once you get married, Japanese women will stop using tatemai. That is why many Japanese married couples have a cold relationship. Today, I would like to help you understand the tatemai of Japanese women. I will refer to this book, Women's Tatemai, a translation dictionary. This book was published by the Japan Women's Language Association to help out ignorant men. So, I would like to show you the true meaning of women's tatemai. This video Will help you understand the real Japanese language used by Japanese women. First, let me introduce the tatemai that Japanese women use when meeting for the first time. Mote so desu ne. Be careful. This is just flattery. It is important not to get carried away and boast about your popularity. If you do, you will be laughed at later. Second, If you go to a party to meet someone and the Japanese woman asks you, どんなお仕事してるんですか This question is also a tatemai question. What they really want to ask is, how much money do you earn? But be careful. To be honest, they are not at all interested in the details of your job. You should avoid talking about your boring work projects. Otherwise, they will be forced to say, Omoshiroi! Which means, Shut the f up! Third, when you ask a Japanese woman, Let's go out for dinner sometime. If she says with a big smile on her face, 時間ができたらこちらから連絡しますね This means, Don't contact me. It also means, I don't want to make time for you. You could say that. If you translate, 時間ができたらこちらから連絡しますね。into English. It means f off. Believe me, I have experienced this many many times. That's why I'm single. Next, I'll introduce Japanese women's tatemai during the date. But this is very important. Even though she agreed to go on a date with you, it doesn't mean you've got a chance with her. It might still be a trial date. She might be interested in your wallet. Or she might just want to learn English. First, when you take her to a restaurant or give her a gift, Japanese women will always say, Sugoi! Steki! Konda no hajimete! This is just a simple filler. In English, you would say, Oh! Or, Yup! When a Japanese woman says this, it should be taken on the same level as breathing. Second, when you are paying the bill at a restaurant and a Japanese woman says, にしよう it means you'll pay, right? 
Furthermore, if you don't realize, this is Tatemae and split the bill. When she looks at the bill and says, Oh, we drank a lot, with a smile on her face. It means you drank too much. Third, if you are on a date on a Friday or a Saturday evening and she says apologetically, Gomen, asta shigoto haichatta. It means that she is lying about having to work tomorrow, but she wants to go home. You should read between the lines and get the fuck out. First, if a Japanese woman says in the middle of foreplay, Hayaku irete? It means your foreplay is too bad. I'm tired of acting. Just finish as soon as possible. It is better to do as she says and finish quickly. It is a waste of time to try to make up for it. Second, if she says, こんなの初めて? She is thinking as if. If it was really their first time, they wouldn't need to say it. When I went to skiing for the first time, everyone could tell. Third, if after making love, a woman says, もっといっぱいしたい? It means you finished too early. You should be very sorry. Please refer to the above when you date a Japanese woman. Although, it has never worked for me yet. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you liked this video, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to check out my Patreon page too. So, see you soon. Bye bye.